What is going on, my friends? Welcome back to Dragon Age 2. This is the calm before the storm, or rather I should say storm before the damn storm. Let's look at the journal, but uh, I'm pretty sure this is it, guys. Yeah, the last straw is, is, is about all we got left and then best served cold. We have this premium content crap that we can't get rid of, sadly. So, okay, what is this about? Seek out first Enchanto Orsino inside the Templar Hall? Okay, well, last episode was Gamlin's quest. Um, we got Uncle Gamlin his gem back, which was his daughter. <laughs> I know, I know. Um, well, we got Gamlin's quest done. We got Avalyn's quest done. We got everyone's quest done. I think... I think we're good from here. I don't think there will be any more quests after this quest, so... It's very uh, nice. I guess I'm ready. I hope you guys are ready. It's been a long run, man. And... We can go back to it's it's going to hit us quick, the uh, the end game here. Okay, let's order some potions while we're here. While well, we got, like, no gold. Okay, completely no gold whatsoever. <laughs> Way to go, Hawk. Spends all his money on damn fucking potions. Look at all the... Oh my god, we got so much. I think... Ah. Eh. I think we're good for this playthrough and a second playthrough, guys. Okay, well, I guess... Templar Hall, um... Aveline, Anders, Varric. Alright, let's go to the damn gallows, man. Let's get this show on the road. The end of all, be all, end all type of stuff going on here. Let's see how our man Cullen's doing. It doesn't look like Thrask is here, man. Where the hell's Thrask at? I don't know. Uh, thank you for taking care of that business with the guard, Captain. Of course. You know me, man. Those robes are gonna get their lesson. <laughs> this guy's still a brooding, man. Good God. I kind of wanted to bring Fenris here, actually. Oh, well. Alright, Templar Hall. Who was it, Orsino? Okay, let's go talk to Orsino. I'm... Kind of looking forward to talking to him. I wonder... This chapter has been very weird. Because we chose to be neutral. It's been a bit different. So we're not... It looks like we got one quest from Meredith. And then one quest from Orsino. I wonder if we... Strategic... Not strategic. I wonder if we just picked a side. Then maybe it would have been that person the whole time giving us quests. I don't, I don't really know. Thank you for coming, champion. Few will associate with me now that I am the focus of Meredith's ire, hmm. which leaves me in a difficult position. She is not entirely wrong. Inform the criers. A miracle has occurred. Uh. I know some of my people are using dangerous means to oppose her, but I cannot seek the Templar's aid without making every mage a target. Um, okay. There is bad mages here, yes, and the blood magic is kind of getting out of control. At least the bad blood mages. Not all blood mages are bad, condemned. They need to be condemned, no. But Kirkwall has seen better days, man. That's for sure. What are they doing? All I know is numerous mages have left the circle at night, sometimes for days at a time. I'd rather not follow our knight commander by leaping to the worst possible conclusion. But the idea of blood magic has crossed my mind. Hmm. Well. She does like to add one and one and get eleven, doesn't she? Sometimes a hundred and eleven. <laughs> I've heard rumors. Whispers of a meeting tonight in Hightown. I would go myself, but should I leave the tower without permission, Meredith would call it proof of my involvement. What if she catches me there? I wonder if she can condemn us into the circle, man. Ugh. So, I shouldn't slip my wrists and dance naked under the moonlight just to fit in. I would pay to see that. <laughs> just learn the nature of this meeting. You needn't interrupt unless you find proof of something sinister. I pray not. Or Meredith will have what she needs to justify the right of annulment. <sighs> okay. Ugh, this Do mess, man. <laughs> I'm getting sick of mages and templars, man. Alright, let's go to Hightown at night. And... Dance naked under the moon and slit her wrist or whatever the hell Hulk was saying he's gonna do. You know, Hulk does jab his weapon through his body. Just saying. <laughs> Slitting his wrist and dancing naked under the moonlight could probably be a thing, Anders. 
Alright, guys. Well, let's move along. Just like I stated, man, fucking Kirkwall is crazy with blood magic. One of the worst lines of blood magic here, man. Why, though? Why is Kirkwall so bad? Is it Meredith's vice grip? It has to be her vice grip that's just making these mages go crazy, man. Good god. Alright, let's get Bow on board. Let's get blood magic on board. <laughs> Dance naked under moonlight. It's a surprise that, like, some of these mages can even escape from the circle, man. You know what I mean? With Meredith's, like, watchful eye, she probably doesn't even sleep, man. Fenris Mansion. My man, Fenris. Kind of wish we would have brought Fenris for this, man. There's Templars and mages here. Interesting. Someone's coming. The champion. We know you're spying for Orsino. <laughs> Run. Okay, dopey. We'll handle this. <laughs> what an idiot. We know you're spying for Orsino. <laughs> All right, let's blood magic him. We drop firestorm on top of him. All right. Temple Lord Lieutenant, let's go ahead and see if we can take him out. Okay. Get out of the way. Go ahead, harm him. Let's get on Varric. Ooh. Man, I'm gonna miss Varric, man. I'm gonna miss his uh, abilities. When it comes to uh, like like he's been like my favorite one this whole game, man. I think Varric. Uh, I say that the Carver was like my. Uh, my Zevron from Origins. I think Varric is the one that really, really rubbed it off of me big time on this one. I've always loved Varric, man, but now it's just... I don't know. Got a lot of love for this guy. Okay. Got more guys just popping in out of nowhere. So. I always hated this spawn rate in uh, Inquisition. Or... Alright, hold on. Let's get Sting on board. The damn spawn uh, in Dragon Age 2. I just like van, like appear out of thin air. Okay, we got a circle mage here. What is he even doing? They're like the worst mages ever. The barrier mages. Crush in prison. Hex him. Okay. We should search them. See if there's any further evidence of their plans. Oh, what the hell's going on? Yeah, good thinking, Anders. Circle Mage, anything? Insignia of something. Templar Lieutenant. Protection of Faith. That's Sebastian. Interesting. A torn note found in a conspir conspirator's pocket. We'll not tell you again. It's not safe to bring new recruits to our meeting. Meredith has eyes everywhere. Bring anyone who claims to be against her to... Guard of Bali's warehouse at night? We must ensure their loyalty, lest Meredith discover us before we are ready to confront her. Huh. Interesting. Another secret society meeting in a warehouse. Do you think the owners charge them rent? I don't know, man. I'm not even sure. I do know that I'm going to get Fenris on board, actually. Because I don't think we have that many more missions, man. And we've been pound around with Aveline for quite a long time. Let's get Aveline out. Fenris. Okay. Best serve cold docks at night. Okay, let's go ahead there. See what the hell we got going on here. Hi, yay, yay. Mages, Templars, Templars, Mages. I love them all. Can't we all just get along, hold hands, dance, something? I don't know. <laughs> Hulk, it's so funny, like, Hulk doesn't even really... Nobody even pays him any mind. Like, he's around throwing fireballs in the middle of fucking low town, dark town, the docks, and nobody seems to pay him any damn mind. Let's go ahead and get in here and see what the hell we can do.
See what the hell's even going on with these crazy Templars and crazy mages. Hey, Anders. What's going on, bud? I think we're better off focusing on the task at hand. Only you. Can't you let loose for once, Anders? Alright, let's get the Varric. I love doing that. Get back to Anders real quick, actually. Take this off, have him get it back on. Let's get Bo on board. Potion. Potion. Let's get everyone with a potion here. Curious to see how Fenris is going to do. Okay. Hawk's the only one don't have a life ward. I don't think Hawk even needs a damn life ward. He's such a beast, man. I have so much damn constitution, it's crazy. I told you he was after hey. us. No, not I him. I remember him. I can't do this. Okay. He's rolling out. <laughs> he said, screw this. Champion's here. I'm out of here, man. Fuck this. Two arms. Okay. Let's go ahead and blood magic the area here. Or uh, this guy. Crush in prison. Hex him. Okay, I heard Varric do uh, triplet, sadly. That's fine. Okay, the enchanter ended up. Okay, he's done. Let's get the arch out of the mix. Eesh. How's Fenris doing, guys? I don't, see, I don't see him taking too much damage. Oh, there's a trap there. Alright, we're gonna have to do this. Just to get off. Anders took a hit from... Okay, there's a hunter. Let's pin him. Anders' life ward has went off, sadly. Go ahead and heal Anders. What's Sendo doing? Fighting one person over there? Alright, let's get Blood Magic on board here. We're gonna need to really work on this guy. Okay, he's... I don't know where he went. There he is. Okay, let's horror him. Let's hex him. Anders needs to heal himself or something. Alright, we'll get the Varric. Take a restoration barrack. Okay, he's almost done. Alright, send heal to Anders. Okay, send. Go ahead and grave rob, please. Oof, we just got backstab. Okay, the enchanter's still going. He's still going. Okay, he's almost done. Okay, he's done. Fenris is... Oof, Fenris took a hit. He just took a massive backstab. Okay. Get Stonewall on Fenris. Let's get back to Sen. His Stonewall just did great for that backstab, man. Okay. Let's get the Varric. I don't know what a barrack triplet, but it was something. Okay, Hulk needs to get blood magic off. Need to heal. Okay, that guy's done. Alright, let's hard this guy. That rest is doing good, man. Okay, he's done. Was that it? Good lord. I told them not to do it. I we saved this guy once. I mean, if I knew you were the one they were talking about, I'd have warned you. I don't hold with kidnapping. Not after what I went through. <laughs> what is he even on about? Talking about kidnapping us? Didn't I save your life? You did. Believe me. I still dream about those blood mages. I don't know where I'd be without you. I'd never have let them kidnap anyone I knew was one of yours. 
Uh, one of mine. Hmm. I don't like where this is heading. They said someone was spying. We needed leverage. Someone they cared about. As a hostage. We just got word they took some lad from the Grey Wardens. Of course it would be Carver. God damn it, man. You bastards kidnapped my brother. We weren't going to hurt him. Just make sure you left us alone. Do you understand? <laughs> Thrask says Meredith will cause open war with the mages if she stays in charge. We have to take her down. We should kill all these suckers, man. Is this whole thing to oust the Knight Commander? She needs to go, don't you see? We need a real Viscount and Templars who protect mages, not oh. massacre them. Just look what Thrask accomplished. Mages and Templars working together. Isn't that what we all want? What has Thrask accomplished here? Okay, they might be working together, but they're still rousing trouble and people are killing each other, as always. I mean, he might arouse some sympathy to the mages, but I mean, what, what has he truly accomplished? Is Thrask the one running this conspiracy? He's the one who brought us together. For six years, he's been working, one mage, one Templar at a time, teaching us we don't have to hate each other. Hmm. He showed us Meredith isn't the only way. I thought you'd be the last person to join a conspiracy of apostate right? mages. They're not lying. They aren't apostates. They want the circle. They want it to work like it's supposed to. To protect them. I don't the disagree there. The mages the problem. Meredith is. The Knight Commander needs to go. That's what Thrask says. Without her, we have a chance at peace. What are you going to do to Thrask? To me? Um... I'm not gonna kill him. At least he's given us information on Carver. Thrask is another story. This isn't going to end well. If I were you, I'd stay out of range. Thank you. I'm really sorry you were the one. Your friends should be fine. They were going to our base on the Wounded Coast. The ruins there. I'll go to Marsha. Try to wait this out. Hmm. I don't think I can serve the Templars while Meredith is still in charge. You probably can't serve the Templars at all. You don't seem to be a very great Templar guy. <sighs> well... I don't fancy them taking my brother. Easy whatsoever. So we're gonna have to deal with this Thrask person. Oh, there's the Blade of Mercy for Fenris. Sweet. Okay, we'll deal with Thrask, man, and whoever else we got out there. Look at these potions this bastard stole from us. <laughs> Remember how uh, how terrible they used to be uh, once upon a time ago? <sighs> funny how things change, my friends. Very, very funny. Okay, let's go ahead and head up here. Go to the Wounded Coast. Wasn't expecting to actually go to the Wounded Coast. Who was that for? Fenris? Very good, Fenris. Interesting. Alright, circle mage stuff. What's over here? The last little roundabout in these uh, buildings. You know, oddly guys, I'm gonna miss these buildings, man. They're starting to rub off on me. Same building over and over. Kinda gonna miss it. <laughs> I don't know why. I just, I just will, man. Dragon Age 2 has its, uh, charm. <laughs> I guess you'd say. It has a hell of a charm. Let's get back to Sen. Oh, man. Okay, so let's talk about this quest here. So Thrask has been working tirelessly to get the mages and Templars to work together. I don't disagree with Thrask. I, I don't think Meredith should be Knight Commander now. I mean, maybe they should account, appoint somebody else, like Cullen. Cullen wouldn't be bad. For these mages here. At least he has a side of them that's decent. From the Cullen that we know. I mean... The Cullen in... At the end of Dragon Age Origins, he was... I don't know. I do agree though, Meredith, Meredith's gotta go, man. That's... The freaking bottom line. Not all mages are weak. True. Hawk, for instance, is not weak. You specifically <laughs> Damn right, Fenris. Me. That's also true. I'll prove to you that I'm not weak. Prove it to yourself. You're convincing no one else. <laughs> Fenris, me. I mean, Anders... 
he's a good mage, man. Anders has been a dear friend. He has been. I wish he would stop talking about mage Templar shit. Okay, let's save. Okay. Got some mages and Templars in the mix. Why don't they just let us go, man? If they don't plan on... Well, maybe they think we're going to stop them, actually. I'm not here doing the bidding of Meredith, that's for sure. Okay, let's get back to Varric. Go ahead and take the lieutenant out. Okay. Pin him. You the man, Varric. Damn right you can, Barry. <laughs> Triplet, man. I love that ability. Damn, this sucker healed. Okay. Let's heal Fenris. He's done. Fenris. Good to see you back there, man. Well, here you are. <laughs> Samson. You've been sticking your nose in every problem in Kirkwall since you stumbled off the boat. <laughs> uh, what can I say, Samson? I love the smell of... Anyways. Who are you again? <laughs> Samson. I'm the one who fouled up your lad Fainriel's escape some years ago. Further back, I was a Templar. But that was before your time. Remember this guy, guys. That's all I gotta say. Are the mages here using blood magic? It always comes down to that, don't it? They claim innocence, demand equality, but back them into a corner, and they got options we don't. Haven't found a mage yet who won't take it. All you guys have options. You got a sword in your hand. You can make a bomb or something. Who knows? I mean, come on. Everyone has options when you back them into a corner. Kind of. Well, maybe not at a snap of a thumb. Snap of a finger, perhaps. You were the upstanding citizen begging coins to get your next flask of lyrium. Mm-hmm. It's a long time since anyone could get under my skin with that. I know what I am. So it shouldn't surprise you to see me here, right? One more blockhead move that's gonna keep me in the gutter. I just wanted to see Meredith out in her ass, like she did to me. Well, she is very unstable. That is for darn sure. Meredith does seem to have a serious case of the crazies, yes. <laughs> but is she wrong? I'd hoped with Meredith gone I could take up the shield again. But maybe she was right. Give him a hint of freedom, mages go bad. Not all, man. Come on. Why? Why does everyone say that? Your friends are right. Without Meredith, Kirkwall can be at peace again. Mages and Templars. Working together. I must be dreaming. It is never that simple. I'd cheer to see her ship to Val Royo. But I don't have the stomach to turn against all that's right and natural to do it. Good God, man. It's... <laughs> the ideal is... Well, it's something. But can it actually work? Hmm. Probably not. Alright, let's see what the hell this mess is about. At least they let us walk into the camp. And there's our brother. Looking mighty it was too much to like a corpse. He wouldn't have come here. Though I can't understand why you side with Meredith now. You showed me we can stand up to her. When I realized you had risked your life lying to protect those mages. Please, champion. I have nothing but respect for you. It's Meredith we must see gone. I'm not siding with Meredith, you idiot. I will not negotiate until Carver is standing beside me. I will not harm your brother. We will release him the moment I have your word that you will support us. No. The boy dies. <sighs> then the champion. You dumb idiot. Stand down, Grace. Grace, we saved you. What are you doing? We will not kill an innocent to achieve our ends. It gains us nothing to become Meredith. Of course. Meredith. 
What do I care for Meredith? I'm here for the champion. This bitch is unhinged. What? what? <laughs> we saved you, you idiot. We saved this lady, right? Am I not? Must am, yeah. Anders even repeated it. We, we saved her. We should have just fucking killed her. I've been wondering when you'd come back to bite me in the ass. Mm -hmm. Decimus was right. There is no way for a mage to live by the Chantry's laws. You killed the best man I ever met. But I learned all he had to teach. He Elaine, summoned kill the hostage. demons I, to kill us. I you don't know Grace. <laughs> and he was also very easy to kill, by the way. Just saying, Grace. I think it took us uh, two seconds to kill him, probably. Try to do a blood mage a favor. This isn't right, Grace. The champion tried to help us. Damn right Don't I did. Me, boy. Ooh, backhanded his ass. Nothing. If you're too squeamish, I'll do it myself. <sighs> My God. No, no one has to die here. <laughs> oh, but that's where you're wrong. Restrain yourself. Forget okay. the hostage. Kill the champion. Obviously, uh, she wants to try to kill us. What do you say we go ahead and call her? Let's see how fast we can kill her. <laughs> okay, Anders. Now you crush him, prisoner. Varric. Go ahead and hit her with triplet. Damn it, Varric. You already used it. <laughs> Goodbye, Grace. You idiot. <laughs> Okay, going to stealth there. Let's get back to Hawk. Okay, she's done. I see a... I think there's an assassin somewhere. There you are. Horror him. Alright, let's get back to Varric. Let's see if he can... Oh my goodness, guys. That brutal effect is just... I think it's borderline overpowered. Did you see how much health he had? Okay, let's get the lieutenant out of the mix. Knock him back down so he can't heal. Okay, healed anyway. Let's get Fenris on board. Okay. Can we not use Spirit Pulse? Oh, he doesn't have it on. Okay, we got Varric. Really good. Sorry, Varric. Okay, um... Let's go ahead and take Mana Potion. Heal Anders. Okay. Let's crush and prison this gentleman. Hit him with a hex. Then horror him. Back to Varric. What is Varric got going? Oh, Varric's over here. Okay, he's... Brittle. Hit him with the Archer's Lance. He should be done. Oh my god. That is ridiculous. He had almost a half of our health. re freaking ridiculous, man. OP, Varric. I knew she was still alive, but I didn't know Thrask was working with her. When I saw her today, it brought everything back. Everything I saw Decimus do. I... I'm sorry. Grace used blood magic to hold him. There's no okay, other well. way to wake him up. I mean, we are... well, never mind. <laughs> you want it for us. <coughs> Get out of my... What? Where am I? Carver! I thought you were better than this. A couple of lousy Templars and you're down. I had no reason to think they'd turn on me. Thank you, brother. 
It seems I am again in your debt. And Shadow. <laughs> They're meeting in here, Sir Cullen. Oh. Look at I this guy. I guess you didn't get on so well with these mages as you thought. <laughs> Champion, Samson never said you were involved in this. I trust you were here to stop these traitors, not well. join them. The Champion's a good man, sir. He tried to solve things peacefully. Yeah. Put the mage to questioning. Um... Don't hurt him, Cullen. There's no reason to hurt this young man. The boy Honestly. stood up to his elders when they would have killed an innocent hostage. Hmm. <laughs> you mean he was one of them, save for a convenient last-minute change of heart? <laughs> Maybe. I'll encourage Meredith to take it easy on him. Thank you, champion. Everyone else here is under arrest. Take them to the gallows. Is there any recommendation you would have me bring to Meredith, champion? Um, give Samson another chance. Yeah, should we? Let's let's tell him to give Samson another chance. Why you should not? Should consider reinstating Samson. When it came down to it, he showed where his heart is. True, Samson, you have done us a great service. Do you wish to take up the shield once more? M more than anything, Knight Captain, sir. Then I'll see what I can do. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Hell yeah, Samson, get it on, brother. <laughs> Thank you. Ah. <sighs> uh. Good God, guys. I really didn't expect us to level up again, man. I, I Last time I put an ability in it, I thought it was like one and done type of ability. But now we have we have options. We definitely have options now. Alright, we need to go back to... Best circle. Where the hell do we gotta go? Return to Orsino. Okay. We got options now, which is good. Oh, magic. Um, I'm gonna give myself haste. Anders all magic. At this point, it really doesn't even matter, man. Um, dispel. Varric. Less threat. That's fine. Fenris. What can we give Fenris, man? That's fine. Okay, let's go ahead and get back, man. Damn, I wish there was a fast travel point from here. What an interesting, weird quest. Like, how did he, why, why would he even think that we were in Cahoots with Meredith? Just because we showed up. I mean, Orosino gave us the damn quest in the first place. You know what I mean? Like, I don't freaking understand. Like, <sighs> I don't know. And then her, what was her reasoning to kill us? Because we killed Decimus? Like, for one, if there was an option to spare Decimus, I might have considered it. There was no option to spare him whatsoever. We had, we were forced to kill the man. There's, I don't even know guys. There's literally nothing we could do and done about it. Ah, whatever, she's eating dirt. The way she should be. Let's go back to the gallows and talk to Cullen if we can and Samson if we can. Alright. I notice you hardly ever comment on mages and Templars and such. That's a lot of humans and skirts. Right, well, you just heard this one. I get them mixed up. Hey Samson, what's going on, buddy? Look at the subject comes up all the time. Tell Hell yeah, about. Samson. And no I'm proud of you, one Samson. Opinions are like testicles. The Knight Commander has dealt with the members of the plot you uncovered. But surely you're the only mage in Kirkwall who can approach the Knight Commander directly Damn right. if you wished. What would you have of me? What is the Knight Commander doing about the conspirators? Did you not see them as you came Probably in? Probably nothing. The Knight Commander will ensure no one follows their example. <laughs> okay, never mind. Everyone says the Knight Commander has gone crazy. Are you still behind her? The people ask too much of her. Okay. I have seen madness before. We already heard all Commander. that. She is not there yet. I just wanted to see how an old friend is doing in yeah, this time. Yeah, we already time. did all that dialogue quite After a while what ago. what happened in Ferelden, I told... But it gra Take it easy, Cullen. <laughs> he just got the same old stuff, man. Those robes are gonna get their lesson. Elaine? Sue, Thrask's dead. Grace is dead. Nothing's changed, Nothing's man. Changed. Of course. As it was going to be, man. <laughs> oh, 
mages and templars I don't think can openly worldwide work together. I think small ragtag bands can probably work together, but the whole animosity between the, between the two is just at this point ancient, I guess, and they're not gonna let it go, man. Okay, let's report back to Orsino. Your mage templar group was conspiring to overthrow Meredith. I have a sudden deep regret I interfered. <sighs> you know, I was half convinced Meredith had engineered the whole thing to trick me into incriminating myself. I mean, she must be overthrown. If Meredith stays in charge, she'll run Kirkwall into the ground. Speak softly, friend. There is nowhere safe to say those words. But be assured, you are not the only one thinking them. Definitely not. Please huh. accept this as my thanks. It will be of more value to you right now than my friendship. Thank you, Orsino. I appreciate it. I'll keep my voice down. <laughs> Let's go tell Meredith. Let's go tell her. Hey, Meredith! You should take care what <laughs> I'm just playing. I wasn't going to tell her. I was just going to go in there and say hi and bye. <laughs> okay, guys. That's it, man. Like we, 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 we have nothing left. Next episode, we are end game guys um maybe might just be a really long episode to be honest with you it's gonna be hard to break it up because everything's gonna happen so damn quick literally i'm just uh, let's go to the black emporium real quick i'm scared nervous um i hope we got enough approval with everyone got everyone's stuff done actually Speaking of approval, we have Fenris's uh, sword. Okay, they don't have any health potions here. We already bought them all. All right. Well, see you later, bum. We stock your shit. <laughs> Let's go talk to uh, Fenris then, at his house. Give him the sword, and then when we come back, we'll we'll initiate um, the point of no return, man. Goodness. I can't believe it's that far already, guys. We're almost to where where I started, Inquisition. Take a look at this. Goodness. A blade of mercy. I remember these. You see them in the Imperium. Replicas of the sword Archon Hasarian used to kill Andraste. This one looks finely crafted. So they sell these things at every market stand in Minrathus? Hardly. Here, let me show you. Ooh, awesome. These are gifts of honor given to those who have performed a service for the Imperium. Denarius coveted them, as I recall. Um, so what would you guys think? Is it a good gift for him or not? <laughs> he hates to mentor. You don't talk about the Imperium much. It's not a place I remember fumbling. All right, let's dig. Doesn't the Chantry forbid mages to rule over men? <laughs> ah, yes. Magic is meant to serve man and not rule over him. In the Imperium, they say that means magic should serve the greater good, which they claim the Magisters do. Do not believe it. Hmm. What do the Magisters do that's so bad? What you call the Circle of Magi rules the Imperium. They control the Chantry as well as the Templars. They claim the Magisters are governed by holy law. But they are the law. They do as they please. All of them. So they all use forbidden magic? The more powerful the mage, the higher he rises in the Senate. He makes the laws, he determines what is acceptable. Everyone who wishes to compete must do the same, or be crushed. Perhaps it wasn't always this way, but it is now. Good God. The slave trade is still in operation in the Imperium. It varies from one Archon to the next. One outlawed it many years ago. He was quickly assassinated. Tevinter <laughs> would crumble without slaves. The Imperium's elite know no other way. Seems like a slave rebellion would end that. There are rebellions all the time, actually. Most of them end poorly. The Senate always unites when faced with sedition. One day, things will change. Then the Magisters will see just how fragile their hold is. I mean, it's hard to rebel against powerful, powerful magic, man. 
I heard that the Imperium has been at war with the Kunari for decades. How can you really? Ever since the Kunari landed on the island of Saharan, yes. Eighty years ago? Perhaps more. The Archon demanded aid from the rest of Thedas. It didn't get him far. <laughs> They've been at war a long time. The Kunari only ever wanted Saharan, which they have. The Imperium has made numerous attempts to retake the island, without real success. I believe the Kunari are saving their strength, building a massive fleet. I think so too, When Fenris. they wish true war, we will know. I was just about to say that I feel like the Kunari is going to eventually uh, invade um, Thetis at some point. Maybe not in this game, next game, but future games. I'm talking like Dragon Age 4, 5, 6, something like that. Are the Kunari that strong? They once fought all the lands of Thetis to a standstill. If they wanted to conquer the Imperium, they would. From what I saw on Saharan, they will not relent. They believe even more strongly than the Magisters that they are in the right. Okay, Fenris, well, keep the sword, The blade man. is yours, if you wanted. For me? Yes. I think I'd like that. <laughs> I'll think of the irony as I wield it. <laughs> Carve Thank destruction. Carve destruction, my friend. You earned it, Fenris. <laughs> Alright, let's go back home, man, and then... I guess we'll save there. Let's go back home and... I don't know, guys. Can't believe it's coming to a damn end. Okay, there's the uh, final mail. Interesting. What's up with Sandal? How come we can't get that damn saying from Sandal? If it doesn't well, trigger now, I don't know when the hell it's going to trigger. Another message came while you were away. It's on your desk. Okay. Sandal? I make Do you now? Anything else? I make enchantments. Sandal? It's very shiny. Anything new? It's very shiny. How's it going, Sandal? Could I have some salamanders, please? <laughs> he doesn't want to say it. <laughs> he like does not want to say this. Sandal. Your house is pretty. Anything I going on, Sandal? Go we can go back to Ferelden one day, my boy. I promise. Sandal. Could I have some salamanders, please? Don't do it. That's where the boom comes from, I think. Sandal. I make enchantments. Sandal. I make enchantments. Could I have some salamanders, please? Don't do it. That's where the boom comes from. <laughs> okay, I don't know when he's gonna. I don't think it's ever gonna trigger. Damn it. Maybe we have to accept this quest and keep clicking on him over and over. Anyways, guys, I'm out of here. Hell of an episode. Um, it looks like next episode might be the last, or the one after that. I don't know. It depends on how. If I could. Push it all to one video. I don't want it going over at least. I don't want it going over an hour mark at least. But anyways, my friends, it's been an honor, and I can't believe we're almost to the end. So, goodness gracious, buckle your seatbelt. It's gonna be a wild ride, guys. So, take care. See y'all next time. Toodles.